West Palm Beach woman froze to death during a hiking trip in New Hampshire. Terry Parker joins us with the story of the search and rescue that came too late. Terry? It did. Kate Matrasova left her husband at the base of the mountains early Sunday morning and by Sunday night was setting off her emergency beacon. But the extreme cold and high winds were too much, and the adventure seeker from West Palm Beach froze to death in the harsh conditions. The search for 32 year old Kate Matrasova, an extreme hiker who traveled the world in pursuit of her passion, ended Monday when searchers found her body in New Hampshire's White Mountains. Reports are she froze to death before she could be rescued. The temperature last night was below 30 below, and um, winds of over 100 miles an hour on the summit. According to New Hampshire Fish and Game, Matrasova's husband, Charlie Farhoudi, a University of Florida grad, dropped her off at 5 o'clock Sunday morning at the base of the mountains. She was planning to hike the summit of Mount Madison and continue through Mount Adams, Jefferson, and Washington. She didn't make it that far and activated a personal location beacon that sent out her coordinates, but they were not exact. Unfortunately, a lot of the coordinates that we received over the night were all over the place within a mile circumference. State and several volunteer organizations started a rescue mission but had to turn around because of the weather. A crew of about 25 went up again Monday and found Matrasova's body between Mount Adams and Mount Madison.